What's going on guys, 2.0 here. Um, I'm alone in the shop right now because uh, Hank is at a meeting for the second store. Um, but it's the day after the God Soul event. Some of the pairs uh, I'm gonna put out right now and do some rearranging of the store. That's why I got some empty spots I'm gonna fill. Um, the day has already started, it's one o'clock. As I'm starting this video, I sold a few Air Force Ones and um, we sell these keychains in store. So, sorry about that guys, you missed some footage, but I'm gonna start the video now. And um, yeah, today should be a good day. We got someone coming in to trade for the uh, Jordan 1 Low Travis Fragments. And uh, we will be buying a few pairs later as well. So stay tuned for today's video. No, I never really try them on until I actually wear them. I mean, I just, I know what I wear. <laughs> Appreciate you. Yep. Uh, thank you. Again. Um, I'm gonna let you my number. Uh, you oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so this is how we're gonna do it. Just, uh, do this yep. and it usually helps when you write what size shoe. Okay. Uh, it's, um, she said she wears a six and a half. In yeah, she wears a men's seven. Is what it is. No, it, she's it, gonna be women's eight, so that's a six and a half in boys. Yeah, that's a seven, but it'll be a little bit too yeah, big. Yeah, man, man, it's weird though. Like sometimes she'll get she'll get the fit. six and a half, yeah. and then sometimes she'll get the seven, and it'll fit. She's yeah. like, it's just one of them weird sizes where she's like right in between the half size and, and the full the right size, one, yeah. and it's weird. And some of the shoes are made just a little bigger than the other ones, and she's scared that if she gets them and they look a little big. She won't wear them. Oh yeah, that's because I, I got her a pair of retro thirteens that. That's a, the shoe already looks big. Yeah, that's what she said too. So that's why she was thinking about going down the next size. So, um, yeah, I just uh, I don't know. Let's just say six and a half, seven. What, what, what is the name? What's uh, the Jordan name? Jordan 6 Gold Hoops. It's uh, Retro 6. Yeah, Gold Hoops. Mm. Yep. Alright. Appreciate yeah. you, man. Okay. No problem. Yep, I will. Yeah, we're going. I know it's kind of hard without the laces and everything like that. I could do, uh, if you want to do two cash or two twenties to a credit. Um, so if you want to look around. Yeah, stuff. I'll look around first and then okay. I'll decide. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I appreciate it. All right, no problem. But yeah, the mummy dunks, they're starting to drop off in her size now. It's pretty disappointing because I paid four after I want the mummy dunks too. Yeah, they look so clean. I was looking at them all saying, bro, I want them with my size now. I know how it is, but here's 200 for the pine green ones, man. I really appreciate it. you, man. Yeah. See you soon. Have a good one. All right, man. See you guys soon. Yeah, I'm going to order it again. Did you have another one? Yeah. I'll just check that one out too. No, I'm just saying, you know, bigger sizes are harder than women. Than women. Yeah, that is happening because I put it in the uh, offer uh -huh. and he paid like automatic. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I cannot take it out. Yeah. So I paid yeah. that too. So, did you want to do trash or trash? Yeah. I Cash or card? No, nah, I want to do this. Cash. Cash? Yeah. Okay, let me look it up real quick. All right. Yeah. 
So you're, we're holding off on this one right now, right? Huh? You're holding off on this one. What is that? Are you? Did you want to take this, or you wanted to? Did you want to do the one? Yeah, one eighty. Oh, you want to do one eighty for this yeah. too? Oh, okay, gotcha. Let me get the rest of the cash. Is it two separate? Because I got the two ten for this. Yeah. Oh, okay. So is this for you? Okay. I'm gonna. Let me go get the other cash for you. So it's gonna be one eighty for the uh, Jordan sixes. Okay. Thank you, man. All right, man. I appreciate you. I think the smallest, but I don't even know if I brought those. They range from nine and a half to eleven. I'm not sure if you'll want to. But we just sold one yesterday. <laughs> Maybe we can get it for the right price. Yeah, I'll do the trade with him. Yeah, so we agreed to buy red fours and um, with the pause. So with the pause and yeah. Yep, yep. How soon do you think you're going to run? Probably tomorrow or this weekend. Tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow this weekend, man. Like, I own a landscaping business, so I never get to wear any of my sneakers. That's why I have such a big collection. And yeah, now that my season's slowing down, I'm definitely going to start wearing some of my shoes. Just because a lot of them I bought dropped so much in price. Would these be like too small for you? No, to be honest, I bought them hoping they'd go up in price like the other. Yeah, but I'm a nine and a half. I range the, these are 11 and a half from her, they're huge, dude. I just rock whatever I can get good prices okay, for. Okay, yeah, it makes yeah. sense. <laughs> I, I used to, but it's just like, like I got a set of back for one. Uh, yeah, and an 11 that he now owns. But it was, I just, I wanted that shoe so bad, it was just too loose. The wife loves the white ball. She's been dying to wear those. I told her, I was like, nah, let's wait to see you. And then, dude, when they started dropping, I was like, you got to You got to dump it. Yeah. Oh, I took about $200 hit on them. Yeah, or something like that. Dude, uh, when we went to Got Soul yesterday, a guy was trying to sell his for like $100 less than what he paid. And I felt bad for him, but even me buying it like 100 less than what he paid is still yeah. no, way no, more than what it, they're worth. So. Oh, dude, most of my, I'd say about. 10, 12 out of my pairs I have, I just took a big hit on just because I like the shoe. I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna, blah, 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 I'm gonna wear it. I'm, then it turns out I never wear it. And then it drops down in price. It's like, oh man, just need to dump them and try to get something I like to wear, like these. All right. And then, so the trade is now complete. We're going to use for those, that's now yours. And then, um, soon as the tank is done, he'll see what he wants to do. Yeah. I think I sent you a picture of most of my collection. If you ever want to just look through it, man. I got, I'm always saying stuff about the volume. Yeah. Who knows when I'm definitely interested in the mummies. <laughs> to be honest with you, man, like I'll probably wear it one more time, man. I'll, I'll let you go, man. Like, it's something about when they glow in the dark, it just makes it so cool. Uh, I have to yeah. in person. Do we have any tea? I don't think we. All we have left is the ones on the track. All those you want to bring? Yeah. No. Okay. Somebody can sign it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did you guys hit on the cool grays? Yeah, we're almost out. We just have like one mince left and like kids. So. 
I was so mad. I missed on EA, but luckily I hit on sneakers when they drop. My What's phone. EA? Uh, exclusive access. Oh, I thought you were talking about like EA Sports. Nah, nah. <laughs> Do you have a price in mind for these? Uh, I don't even know what they're going for now. Man. Well, the market's a little wonky with them because I'm passing them. Yeah. Um, so. We would probably be at the prices where they were going for before he passed. Okay. I mean, it's not too much more. It's like maybe a few bucks more, but uh, I could do it for 80 for these. Let's see which one. Are these the two or the four? That's the four. Yes. Would you say 380? Yeah. You can't do four? I'd be at 380. I mean, you might get a little bit more here. All right, let's put that one to the side. Just okay. wait to see. I hit one. I actually hit on the last day, mm -hmm. but then I got, I bought these and I paid a little bit more for them off though, so that's why I'm a little. Yeah, you do. Yeah. Uh, should have brought the other one and I actually hit it. Well, if you look at it from a price point, you could just offset your price. That's right, that's what I just did, yeah. It's true. These I'll be at retail, which is 225 Okay. Want to do that? Yeah. It's something they re-released them. Kind of no, I know, and they just caught. They're such a like a cool looking sneaker. I was like, oh man, you know. Yeah, I do like them so. We've been buying a two forty. They are doing well. Probably a two forty. Okay. Is that fine? Yeah. Honestly, I got them because I was I'm an Eagles fan. And I thought they matched uh, a little bit better okay. with the Eagles color, but they don't really. No. So it's like, Do you have a price of mine for these? I think I was going for a little over five last time I shipped. I haven't really got to check the market on that. Yeah, it's, I couldn't do market. I can do a little under. So what's your Um. Yeah. I can do 450. I would hold Yeah. I'll probably hold on to these. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's just gonna be a tougher move. No, I know, I get it, man, I get it. I own a business too, so I understand how to make your money too. And this is the last one. If you wanna do 380, if you do 380, let's see where we'll put you at. So if you do 380, you get 845. I'll just do it even 850. So you're talking cash. Cash. Yeah, that was part. Yes. Okay. So 850, 43? Yep. All right. Let's actually check for just a little bit. Is all your stuff by sizes? Nah, it's by style. Okay. Alright, so we're just going to do the Kobe. This is such a good shoe. It so sucks cool. the cut small. So yeah. 11 would be, I've had a, well, he had an 11, so. Okay. Alright, so we'll do five. I already gave you cash for these three. And I'll do five for this one. Two, three, four, five. Awesome, you get to leave what you want, we get what we need, right? That's awesome, buddy. Thank you so really much, guys. Yeah. Yeah. somebody. I just seen the Nike game for these. I've had them since the release okay. for a minute. <laughs> They're brand new. So they really don't go for much? Yeah, no, I know. I got out of shoes a while ago, so okay. I'm just trying to get rid of them. Uh, I could do like 240. It's good for you. 250? I'd be at 240. Yeah, fuck it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. Go get a cash on the back. Okay. One, two, twenty, and forty. Appreciate you. Thank you for stopping in, man. Yeah, All right, see you soon. Should you grab these for two sixty? Yeah. Get some keychains. They only five. Thank you.
Alright guys, got a mystery box from uh, one of my reseller friends. Um, I'm not going to give him a shout out until after I see this box because of this trash. Me and him are going to have some problems. So let's take a break from today's in-store festivities. I closed the gate so nobody can interrupt me. Hopefully this is a good box. I haven't ordered a mystery box personally in a while. It was fifteen hundred dollars, so uh, he used a lot of tape, so I could say he did a good job on the tape. But yeah, we're not here to talk about tape. We're here to talk about this box. So I just see a Jordan 1 box. The lid came off. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna put this box down because I can't see what's in it. Just... Alright, so I guess this is what was in that Jordan 1 box. Got some pre-owned Jordan 1s on the side. 12. I've actually never owned this shoe before, so it's my first time seeing this shoe. Well, it'll be my first time trying to sell this shoe. I do need to clean it up, but it's not bad. It's the first shoe in the box. Alright, and that lid we had was a Jordan 10. I believe these are the Seattles. Shout out to Sneak City because um, their store is in Seattle. I watch them sometimes on YouTube. Tia and Anastasia, they're killing it. But yeah, we got some pre on Seattle 10s. Um, I gotta clean them up, but it doesn't need that much to clean. It's a size 11 and a half, so we'll see if my brother wants it, because that's the size. Right, so we're two shoes in. I spent 15, 25, because I paid for shipping. Um, I would say we're probably at I don't know what this is worth, but I know I'm definitely at about 300 in value, so. All right, see so the Jordan 1, another Jordan 1 box. Um, it's kind of half shown. I feel like it's a starfish. It is a starfish. It's a 10 in women, so this is an eight, eight and a half in men. Um, yeah, these shoes keep restocking. Uh, I felt like this would be like a $300 shoe, but they just keep restocking. Maybe next week they will stop again, so we'll see. So I think these are worth uh, probably 200. So I'll say we're like at 500 in value so far. So $1,500 left to, no, not 15, $1,000 left to give to. So let's see. We got some Yeezys. Size nine and a half. I don't know which one it is. Okay. Pre-owned. Um, I've actually never owned this pair before. The previous owner spent $513 on these. Woo! Definitely won't be getting that because these are used now. But these are the Sunset Oranges. So, um, yeah. Box is looking good so far. Um, nothing has came in my size, so. Everything will be for sale. And um, yeah, next year. This box is damaged. I feel like it's a Nike Dunk. And it is. It's a UNLV in a size 8. Nope. This is a size 10. So this is actually my size, but I already have this shoe. So I don't need it. Um, the previous owner wore with one white lace and one red lace. It doesn't look good to me, but hey, and this is a, a replacement box shoe. So, so far we have um, five shoes, and I would say uh, this was 300, 500, 
750. So we're at about 900 in value and there's two shoes left. Um, obviously once the video is done, I'll do the real math, but. Got a Jordan 1 box. It's a big box, size 13. Shout out to my big feet people. It's a Royal Total 1. Um, it looks brand new. Lace bag, lace bag is still attached. Um, so, yeah. I know these go for at least 300. I'm not sure if they go for more until I look it up, but definitely have 1200 in value so far with these four. With these six, and let's see what this last shoe is. I feel like it's a Bread 11 because that's what comes in these boxes. So, yep, it's a Bread 11 in a size nine and a half. Um, Hank just texted me, let's read y'all what he said. Uh, he didn't text me words, he sent me a video, so I don't know what that is. Um, hmm. Are these dead stock? I think I got a dead stock pair of bread elements. The box is slightly damaged, but these shoes appear to be dead stock. Y'all know Hank, y'all know he smells everything. So yeah, they smell good to me. They smell dead stock, um, though, the insole has like no wear on it and it still has that sticker in there so before i brought these out um, i thought the value was 1200 uh, i think these are a 400 dollars shoe so i definitely got 1600 dollars worth in value which is definitely a profit but i'm gonna go ahead and cut the clip and do some math and i'll see what we i'll see what the real value is all right So you put that square on the cash app and it'll come right up. And then you just type in the amount you're sending and then it should work. How soon you think you're gonna wear these? What? How soon you think you're gonna wear these? Um, I'm not sure. Okay. <laughs> it's an easy shoe to wear, you know, it's mm -hmm. black and white. Yeah. So I just hit pay after I put it on the store. Yeah, I know. That's great. Yeah. yeah. This is your first time buying something from us? Yeah. Okay, because he bought shoes. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see it Yeah. Nah, look at your bag. I'm not right. just giving you a shoe. Yeah. <laughs> Nike ever ever gonna gonna do a Travis Scott thing again? Or you think they're not gonna do that? Travis Scott shoes? Yeah. Yeah. You um, think that they're gonna get over that shit to happen? I mean, hell yeah. Because they, yeah, they, I mean, they, it's, they it's have delayed bad, them. They, I think they delayed the. Um, I think they delayed one drop. It was supposed to happen like. Look at look at it like this. When Kobe had that incident, you know he lost a lot of sponsorships, but then you know after time, yeah, he got back. You know to everyone loving him. So. I mean, they just need, you know, give it a few more months and then yeah. everyone will try to see it. I still I, love I don't, them. I still love them. I don't give yeah. a fuck. I, don't, I, don't I mean, it just, it just sucks. Like, they just need more security. You know, people should have just yeah. act accordingly. Like, now they, Cacti dropped and like, uh, or Bush, the parent company that yeah, owns all those things. Stuff. He, he lost, lost Cacti. He lost McDonald's. Like, they took most all the money he got from his sponsorship with them. Like, he lost a lot of stuff, but... I think, yeah, I, I think they delayed a pair. They delayed all the Air Maxes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I seen them at the Got Sold and answered it. Like, some people had just pairs. Because if you went to the Astro World, you could have bought it there. Yeah, that that's what, I saw this. I had some more uh, research, and it's like Nike, this was the last one, and they, they, they stopped. Well, hopefully it'll come out. That's a nice color. I know, I do like them. Um, but, we'll see. Yeah. I tried every every time they they release that 
tried for them, but I never got them. Have you ever hit on Travis Hill sneakers? Neither have I, have you? Hell, no, man. I've only hit, I've been, I've been doing sneakers for, uh, since February of 2020, like right before COVID. I hit one time on sneakers. Which ones? Uh, undefeated, a brick? The undefeated ones in March. Is it a brick undefeated or one of the good ones? Uh, I, I, I they were like, black. I've hit quite a few shoes on sneakers, but I think I've been doing it longer than you. It was March 2020. Those ones there. I don't even know what that is, but yeah. Uh, they went, they were 150 retail. I think I got them for like 320. You sold them for 320? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, they were, they were, uh, they were big release. Um, I think people liked them because all, all black. And um, yeah, I mean, at least you doubled your money. Did you hit on sneakers? Um, but I've tried to. I, I just started probably like a month ago. Mm -hmm. I just started getting into this stuff. I would only collect them. Mm -hmm. Like I was a big fan of like Yeezys and stuff like that. And then I was like, oh, why not just make money off? Yeah, them? on the side, you know. Yeah. Make so your, um, I bought a couple slides and I'm selling them all. Okay. Like I just bought a pair of Pierre's. The kids, kids buying them at my work for three hundred. Three hundred. Yeah, they scam the like, fuck out of them. I'm not scamming. No, I got them for. Don't they, they really know, go for like two twenty ish? Two. 250. Okay, well, three is not that bad. Yeah. Yep. What, what, uh, do you guys use a, use a bot for drops? Yeah, most of the time we hear. Like, when shoes come out, we're, you know, we got open the stores, so, um, we turn our phones, we can't get it, you know, people try to bring and sell our shoes, but if we can't agree on a price, then we don't get the shoes. Like, there's I've been grades what? I want for those. And you ain't getting none? No, that was, that I got was a one, cluster. I got one, one pair. Uh, yeah, I did. I, um, I sold on StockX. Um, I, I was talking to the guy the other day. I came in. I was scared shitless because I, I accidentally put them on. Like I, I hit the post button on an accident like the day they came out because it's being shipped to me. But they uh, shipped today, so I, uh, I, I sent it out to StockX today. But okay. I accidentally put it on because they they bone you with the fifty dollar uh, thing if you're out yeah, late. Yeah, I've never. I've I never. Did. I had to experience that. But I was I was scared for a second because like I didn't think it was gonna be like uh, shipped until yeah. but it came from Camp Hill so I called them up, I said, Is there any way I can like get them? And they said, Yeah, we we, we already shipped them out. So, so I got I got when, real lucky. When you sold it on Stock X, how much did you make? Uh I got it for three twenty because I did it as soon as they dropped. Like after I after after I got confirmation from Foot Locker, I put them on. I made 320, so 320. Actually, now it would have been fuck. Seller fees, 294. It tells you on your account. 69. Okay, it's not bad. But I would have liked to, like Bryce, if you know Bryce, um, he's like raspy kid. He's like, Ay -ay. that's how he talks. Short, it's like fat, curly hair. <laughs> he was here with us. I don't know if you remember us. We were here a couple weeks ago. Yeah, he's on the ask for the off lights. If you, if you guys had any off. Had any off whites? Oh him! Yeah, that's your friend. He gets fucking lucky. It's Dude. annoying. You know yeah, how much is annoying. He, he, he makes gets so fucking much lucky. Awesome. Yeah, I heard about him. He be uh he be taxing people. He does. Mm. Yeah, he fucking he he hit eight eight pairs from Foot Locker. At one cool, location. Cool yeah. One location? Yep. Here, eight pairs. How how the fuck? And what are you selling for? Uh, I guess he, I guess he put him on. He told me today he sold uh, three, three of them to people he knew, and then the the rest on StockX. I don't know if he, I guess he got a buyer. I'm not sure. I didn't ask him. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm guessing he probably made around what I made because if you look at StockX price now on them, they're down. They're yeah. down, yeah. So uh, hopefully somebody comes sell us it would yeah. be affordable for us. Yeah. That kid's, that kid's nuts. The way the way he makes money off that shit. But I mean, you gotta you gotta respect the hustle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone doesn't want to put in the work, but yeah. everyone wants to make money just sell shoes. Yeah. So, he's already got like a head start. Um, you know. Oh yeah, I know because Daddy fucking Warbucks gave him money to start. No, it's not about that. It's like even if even if someone gives you money, like you still gotta put in yeah. the work to hit yeah. eight pairs. So mm -hmm. you gotta do research. So how much? How can I hit eight pairs? But he is insanely lucky. He doesn't have a bot, nothing, and he he sells. I hit eight pairs, and I was and I worked. Yeah. That's yeah. crazy. I, I've never experienced that. I've never experienced more than like three at one location. If I didn't work Cool Bear Release, I would have had like over 20 pairs. But that's crazy. because you know, I know where I'm going and I know my city. So. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I just, um, I have people, um, 
use their their uh, phones and log into my account and use my card and, or not my account but their account and use my card and look for quotation stuff. Um, but I've only ever hit the under the the on sneakers. It's just it's just what happens. <laughs> But uh, anything else I've sold, I've gotten from like foot sites, yeah. like foot, like Foot Locker champs, Foot Action, stuff like that. Um, I've hit a couple on can on can on confirmed. I got the the Easies from there today. The slides. I got. Um, I didn't get the seven hundred. I got the last five hundred drop before the copper fades. Playgrounds. Yeah. Playgrounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got those. All right, well, I mean, you at least you're doing something. At least you're hitting on okay. uh, Yeah, I'm, I'm making money. It's not like I like it's 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 enough to where I don't have to get a job right now because it's enough. Like a hundred dollars, like whatever here and there, is making. I don't like spend money like it's nothing. Yet. So I'm just doing what I gotta do to where I go on to have a job. It's good so. to hear. But I mean, it's not gonna last long. Like once I like once I go to college, I'm gonna have to. You need to sell more pairs yeah. to afford college, you know? Not probably. But we'll see what happens. I'm just starting. Oh, yeah, I know. Time. You got whoever you sold these black slides to, you're going to Or whatever. What's in the, what's in the name of here? Dante. No, Dante. No, Dante. Dante. Yeah, you're stupid. I can't believe you did that. Uh, All right, man. All right, see you guys. Yep. Have a good night. All right, guys. That's going to end today's video. Um... We're not closed yet, but I got some work to do. I'm about to put out some pairs um, before I leave. And also, shout out to Harrison Neville and DJ Ski. Got them playing in the back. Um, Harrison's showing DJ Ski's sneaker collection right now. Um, guys, if you enjoyed today's video, leave a like. If you got something nice to say, drop a comment. If you haven't done so already, uh, subscribe. And... Um, I'll see you guys next time I work. And oh, about the mystery box. Shout out to my guy, Tri-State Plugged. Um, he said the mystery box was supposed to be 25 to 30% return of investment. Um, I didn't really do the math yet. I'm gonna do it later when I get home. But from what I see, I think it's gonna be a good box. I got a variety of shoes. I got new and used, all different sizes. So yeah, shout out to him. And um, yeah, it's your boy Sneaker Hen. Working at Sneaker Tech, and I'm out.